Hi, I'm Caitlin Bergari. I'm a thrower for Rockport Track and Field, and this is my senior interview. It's good to see you, Caitlin. First question, how has lifting made you more successful for being a thrower? Um, so while lifting for like uh, four years with track, it has allowed me to um, put on more muscle mass to throw like heavy implements, but also learn explosiveness um, and technique that I can easily translate to my throwing technique in competition. Explain how your relationship with Coach Hallett has made you more successful. I have known Coach Hallett from um, having him as a teacher in middle school about six years ago. Um, and he is a coach. He does really well at um, teaching us mental toughness and uh, teaching us how to overcome certain bumps in the road and how to translate that um, what kind of emotions are you feeling knowing this is your last year? It's really sad to think about that I won't have to go to practice and see my wonderful teammates every day, but also exciting in a way that I know I'm going to hit my best marks this year and um, do the best I possibly can. Next question, what's been your most memorable moment in track and field? There have been a lot of memorable moments, and I say most of them come from my sophomore year. Um, so I was younger in the throwing and everybody else was seniors, but we would spend late nights at meets at RIT, uh, and they would go to like 1 or 2 a.m. and we wouldn't get home till then. And then we would always go to Jimmy Z's at like 2.30 in the morning with all of the teammates and it was just a really good bonding experience. Do you plan on continuing track and field after high school is over? That is in question right now. I've talked to a few coaches in different colleges. Um, but I'm just deciding if I want to have that strict schedule with a more heavy workload with college and um, getting used to the, the college workload. What's your favorite event to compete in? In season right now, weight throw. Um, but if I have to choose between indoor and outdoor, it would be discus because uh, you get to feel like you're flying with a lighter implement and just uh, going around in the circle and watching it uh, fly off of your hand is, I think it's really satisfying for me. Do you have a role model you look up to? If so, who? Um, I look up to my older sister for teaching me how to work hard and showing me that work hard does pay off. What are your hobbies outside of track and field? Uh, I enjoy spending time with my friends when I do have the time since I'm, I have a really busy schedule right now. Um, but I also enjoy just going to the gym and lifting in the off season and creating like my own workouts and, and learning a lot more about workouts and how to plan them. What are you most excited for about sections? Uh, I'm most excited for just the experience. Uh, we haven't had like a real sectionals or a real meet in a long time due to COVID. Um, but also just seeing how everybody else does because we're all, us seniors, we're all hitting our best marks this year. And I'm also excited to hopefully place top three. And that's my goal. Last question to you. What does it mean to be a Brockport athlete? It means a sense of community and family. Um, all Brockport athletes, we all support each other and want each other to do the best they can. And I believe that's really important when you're an athlete. All right, well, thank you for your time, for doing the interview, and good luck. Thank you.